Welcome to Midwest Sports Net. Thanks for stopping by. Hi, I'm Joey McWilliams. I'm glad you're watching today. We appreciate that. And I encourage you to stick around. Please do subscribe to the channel. We cover lots and lots of sports, specifically small college sports here. And you know, it's been a long four and a half months for sports fans, those who play sports, those who broadcast sports, those who just like sports. In general, you have to go back to March 12, 2020. It was the day that sports pretty much went on hiatus. Of course, the day before was when Rudy Gobert was tested positive, or at least it was revealed that he tested positive uh, for the virus. That pretty much shut down the NBA, and then sports just took a, a side road after that. That was on March 12th. Here we are, the last day of July, and we get to start talking sports again. We've had on Midwest Sports Net the hashtag Time of No Sports along with so many of our videos, and I think that is done at this point. Of course, Major League Baseball is back just yesterday. The NBA started back up again. The National Hockey League is back. The NFL looks to be back, and of course, college sports, college football in particular, I think has had the roughest road to getting back to where it needs to be, and I know it's not going to look exactly like it has in the past, but it's going to be nice to have it back, and so National news coming out again today. Let's go ahead and go to the NAIA, and we will talk about the NAIA right now. News coming out today on Friday about the NAIA postponing the fall national football championship. It's going to be held in the spring. Now, one of the things about this, as uh, it says here on the NAIA website, that the decision came after the Council of Presidents voted earlier in the week to postpone championships in all other fall sports except football pushing all of those championships to the spring. They wanted a little bit more time to talk about football. They came to that decision, and that was announced today that uh, it's going to be pushed to the spring. Now, one of the things about this that really is, is pretty cool, I like this a lot, the decision still allows for NAIA conferences to compete in the fall and winter if they choose to do so. So the conferences themselves do have the, the freedom to be able to hold regular season competition in the fall. And a number of conferences have already done that, of course, here within the, the Midwest Sports Net footprint. You talk about the KCAC, of course, the Heart of America Conference, the GPAC, uh, among others, have already said, hey, listen, we're going to go ahead with sports as scheduled. Now, you go back to the very beginning of the month of July. Here we are on the last day of July. The first day of July, the NAI put out some guidelines and some, uh, well, standards as to how to go about business for the fall and, and uh, what it would look like uh, with these these recommendations for NAI schools, how to return to play, what was going to be expected uh, in, in the fall, and if there were going to be championships in the fall, there had to be certain number of schools that were cleared to play. Now, for football, because we're talking about football, at least 47 schools that were cleared to play. Uh, give or take as to whether or not we'll have 47 schools when everything is said and done and all the different conferences have their say-so as to who's going to be doing what. Probably was a wise decision to go ahead and push the championship to the spring and, and give then all of the different schools or conferences an opportunity to be prepared for that championship. We talked about the KCAC, the GPAC, the Heart of America. They're all going to be moving forward with games as scheduled and all of the Games that are scheduled for fall sports other than football can get way, get underway on September 5th. Football, those games aren't to start until September 12th. Now, we did get word today, yesterday actually, from the Sooner Athletic Conference. No, that came out today. The statement from the Sooner Athletic Conference uh, coming out today about cross-country, soccer, volleyball, how those games were going to be played, some in the fall, some in the spring. Football actually is pretty interesting here as the Sooner Athletic Conference is going to build a new schedule for the football uh, slate, if you will, that's going to take place in 2020 and into 2021. The Sooner Athletic Conference teams will be provided three games in the fall and six games in the spring. Now, we've seen some other conferences in Division II say, hey, we're going to play the bulk of our games in the fall and make up some other games in the spring. It's going to be a little bit different for the Sooner Athletic Conference. They're going to play three games in the fall and then six games in the spring. And then it's only the six games in the spring that are going to count toward a conference championship. 
So that's interesting there, the way that that is scheduled out, uh, leaving six games to determine the, the SAC championship. And the conference scheduled games in the fall will begin no earlier than Thursday, October 15th. Now, the last thing that we'll mention here today on Midwest Sports Net is this. Some conferences will be playing in the fall regular season competition in the fall. Some conferences will be playing regular season competition in the spring. And that becomes interesting as to how then you're going to put together your playoff situation in the NAI because there are automatic berths to the playoffs by winning a conference or division within a conference, but then there's some at-large teams, and those at-large teams make their way in and have to be within a certain number in the poll. And these polls are going to be spread out, it looks like, for, you know, could be seven, eight, nine months. And how difficult will that be for these pollsters to keep up with how good a team was in the fall as compared to how good another team might be in the spring and and keep all of this uh, on the forefront of your mind when you're filling out those polls. Of course, Midwest Sportsnet, uh, we are a part of the NAI F-ball football poll, national poll, which started last year. And and uh, we'll be keeping up with that as well. Of course, that's not the official poll that the playoffs are determined by, but it is something to keep up with. So again, word from today, this last day of July, the NAI is postponing now football along with all of the other sports. The championships for the fall sports will be played in the spring, but again, conferences can have their regular season competition either in the fall or in the spring. doesn't matter. The championships will be in the spring. Thanks for watching Midwest Sports Net today. I just encourage you, please, subscribe to the channel here. We'd love to have you come back and watch some more. We'll continue our coverage of small college sports right here on Midwest Sports Net. God bless you. Have a great day.